WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny and very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a sea of red out there. You've got all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the downside. Dow's down about... Um, Less than one tenth percent, 30 points there. Eight tenths, though, for the SP or 35. One and a half percent for the NASDAQ, 212 point move there. Russell's down one and two tenths or 20 points. A little over two percent, two and a quarter percent nearly for the uh, semis. They're down 73 points. Trend is off two percent, 275 point move there. Gold is up two bucks, with silver being down 13 cents. Light three crude is off 48 pennies. Natural gas up a couple pennies. And the 30 year treasury down nearly one point, trading out at 109.02. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that number panel market update chart we begin with the es mini upper left hand side new information that we've got out here is a new profile that is attempting to form it's got support at 4234 resistance at 4318 423550 is a buy the d point pattern price closes below that well we've got a um, it should lead to lower price out there but we do have that new profile 4234 and a quarter use that we won't be able to, we won't have confirmation of that profile until tomorrow or this evening if we take a look at the spot volatility, it's still above its 50-day exponential moving average. That gives sellers the edge. The NQ is testing its TD9 count bottom. That's at the 14,586 level. There was a new profile that did form. It is bullish in structure. So price right now is trading inside that buy zone. The buy zone is between 14,599 and 14,855. We're trading right now at 14,640. We take a look at the U.S. dollar index. Given up some of its early gains out there, it is also trading into its sell zone structure. It's a bearish structured profile. And that's between the 105.99, 106.42 level. Level. Gold formed a new profile yesterday. The bottom, which are support, is 1919.80, and the top is at 1986.40. But your real resistance level is the TD9 count top. And that's up at the 2009-20 level. That's the area, that's the level that price needs to close above in gold to tell you it's off to the races. If we take a look at silver, it also formed a new profile yesterday. Price consolidating with inside it, support at 2253, resistance 2330. Light speed crude, it's trading into its buy zone. That's the buy zone of its bullish structured profile. That's between the level of 81.43 and 83.88. Natural gas yesterday or two days ago tested and rejected its swing point low, but today it's testing and rejecting the top of its daily profile. That's up at the level of $3.38 out there. Watch that. If take a look at the 30 year treasury. It's got a Rhodes momentum indicator bottom pattern. Just needs to continue to stay above the 109.09 level. If we could do that, Price should run into that descending trend line resistance today. That's priced at about uh, 111. Stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show, but if you have to start your Wednesday, please have a wonderful.